For summertime in the bluegrass, it really doesn't get much better than this. As we saw a lot of sunshine, it was warm, but not so humid here on your Wednesday. So overall, today's forecast is a hole in one, and we are expecting a bit more of the same as we head into the first round of the tournament, the Barbasol Championship, in fact, as we look towards the day tomorrow. Now, outside right now, we're taking a live look from our Barbasol camera, just overlooking the 18th green, a bit on the warm side. Temperatures at Bluegrass Airport, just 10 miles up the road. Checking in at 86 this hour. We have been seeing some puffy cumulus clouds throughout the day, but overall, that's the only thing that has been decorating our skies. We've been going throughout the course of your Wednesday. Now, the Max Track Lab Doppler has been quiet throughout the day too. Again, on the dry side today, but it's not going to stay that way as we continue throughout the course of the tournament. As we look across the uh, Ohio Valley now expanding with satellite and radar, you will notice over just the past three hours, some puffy cumulus clouds have been developing, especially puffing up with the heat of the day, but the storms have stayed off to our west. Most of the activity closer to the Mississippi River as we've been going through this mid stage of the week. Now, future track is going to show quiet conditions. We continue through the overnight hours. Those all going to still be thanks to high pressure that is parked off to our north across the Great Lakes. So ushering in that more refreshing air mass as we continue even throughout the day tomorrow. But with a little bit of a wind shift, we will be tracking some changes to roll in. So if you do have plans to head out to the first round of the Barbasol Championship tomorrow, be prepared for more sunshine. It's going to be warm, but we are going to start to add the mugginess back in as the day goes on. So be prepared for that. So just pack the sunscreen. Again, if you're going to be heading out early in the morning, temperatures will be running in the mid 60s. Later in the day, skies will go partly cloudy, getting a little bit of shade like we're getting right now. And again, it will be on the warm side with temperatures in the mid 80s. Let's now head over to future track. Again, we are going to be tracking just clear skies tonight. It will be relatively comfortable with lows in the lower 60s. Then tomorrow, a few more clouds puffing up into the afternoon. We're even showing signs of the potential for a stray shower or two to pop up especially into the mountains of southeastern Kentucky. But I think things are going to be dry here at Keene Trace tomorrow. We won't be so lucky, though, as we head into Friday, which, of course, will be moving day for the pros. We will be tracking a line of showers and thunderstorms to roll in into the afternoon hours. That is going to be accompanying a cold front, which could be bringing the potential for some strong to severe thunderstorms. So overall, over the next couple of days, Tomorrow, the pick day. Over the weekend, though, make plans to pack the rain gear. Things are going to be getting soggy with rounds of showers and thunderstorms. The greens will be soft for the pros. Some may like that, others may not. I guess we'll have to see how the impacts play over the weekend. And of course, as a reminder, with weather potentially moving in, in fact, some of those storms could be on the strong to severe side. Friday evening and Friday night. Don't forget you can take the Max Track Live Doppler and the LEX 18 Storm Tracker forecast with you in the palm of your hand. Just download the free LEX 18 Storm Tracker weather app. It'll be a great tool as you're away from your TV, potentially taking in some action here at Champions at Keen Trace over the next couple of days. So the forecast for tonight looking pretty good once again. You could almost sleep with the windows open with lows in the lower 60s. But then your eight day forecast takes us back more to summer like conditions. We will be tracking the rise of the muggies tomorrow, followed by storm chances to start to creep in during the second half of your Friday. The weekend looking pretty close to being a washout as we'll track rounds of showers and thunderstorms. And even into next week, we'll continue to track more typical summertime conditions with highs running in the 80s. For now, we're reporting live from Champions at Keene Trace here in, Nic in Nicholasville. Let's send it back to you in the studio. Boy, that weekend forecast.